my way to Prelude Beach now. Uh, you got new stuff? Yes, you do. Mechanical tub. Ooh! That must be a new Rotom form. Uh, I packed with gears and machinery. Yep. That is indeed another Rotom form. I will buy them all. kind of cool just seeing the grass floating on the path back there like that oh he probably wants the battle if he's in his armor I'll just leave my Arcanine up front Prelude Beach indeed the place of beginning that was not the time for words. Face me in battle. Knew it. So he dons his armor when he wants to fight. Alright, buddy. That's not Braviary. I'm catching the three leg spirits. Good luck! I'm going for the hard fight! Alright, Vion. You're up. Go for the water pulse. That's one. There's the Snorlax already. Um, I'll just leave Fiona. Moonblast. Oh. Oh dear. It took me one ball. <laughs> what? <laughs> Are the legendary is just easy to catch in this game? Never mind, I meant 
for this to happen. Frightful creatures like Pokemon can become powerful allies. You've grown even stronger since we faced one another on Mount Cornet. It's clear you do not view Pokemon as dangerous enemies, but rather as trustworthy allies. <laughs> allies with whom you can reach great heights. Perhaps you are a divine being yourself sent to bring us gifts from above. Here, you should have this. Ah, the punchy plate. When the very first of our galaxy expedition team, myself, Benny, and the others set foot on Prelude Beach, we found that plate. It clearly held some kind of power, so, and so I've held, I've kept it safe all this time. I find it fitting that it should now end up with you, who likewise arrived here on the same beach. Perhaps something is guiding us. Indeed, it must be so. You and I, Adam and Urida, it appears we're all being guided by one called Almighty Sinnoh. It might be more appropriate to call this region the Sinnoh region. Oh, <laughs> I know I have no right to say this, but we are truly fortunate to have been able to count you among the Survey Corps ranks. If you had not joined us, we would have fallen on Mount Coronet. We would have lost our home. We would have lost our future. Now then, carry on with your survey work. The knowledge that you collect about the wild Pokemon in this region will serve to illuminate our path forward as we walk into the future. I sh definitely agree with you. Based on her hints, there might be four more plates. Okay. Um... Go to the front gate. Um, mass outbreak of Glalie and Geodude. Hmm. Well, no. Let me see these missions. So well, there's mess. You see, Max. You see, Mesper and Zelf, Heatran, Cresselia, and Regigigas. Hmm. get Heatran first. The festival, attended by everyone in the clans and galaxy team alike, oh, it was wonderful. Being able to spend time with this skin in front of everyone was like a dream come true. Black Star, Lena, oh, I'm sorry, Paulina, here has something she wants to discuss with you. That's right, she's also here to see Rita. Seems something is once again very much amiss on Fire Spit Island. Oh, Fire Spit Island? Oh dear, you seem reluctant to get involved. It's just very hot there. My, you speak in such this disparaging terms of the seat that the, my lord Arcanine calls home, and to think you call yourself our leader, Irida. Uh, no, Lena, I didn't. Oh, stop at the silly old nickname in front of others, won't you? I'm sorry, I didn't mean anything by it. It's just an, an old habit. Well, anyways, you heard her. No, wait. Anyways, you heard her. Please get the fire spit island so we can resolve this. Truly, please hurry. I might melt out there. 
Oh, sorry, I gotta check something real quick. On here. Oh, a fat perug. Is that tree shaking? That one is. What about that one? No. That one's not. There's a hotch crow. I actually think I had that hotch crow a shiny once. Because it was nighttime and I heard a shiny noise around the area. But it turned a day right when I got over there, so I never found whatever it was. Uh, hello, Blackstar. Thanks for coming out so far out of your way. Warden Iskin, wasn't Lena joining us? Uh, yes, about that. Um, it seems she wanted some time with her lord, so she asked us to te check the Lava Dome Sanctum without her. What the nerve of... She knows I can't stand sweltering places like this. I'm sure she meant no ill will. The Warden of the Lord of the Isles is such a kind, gentle soul. Anyways, shall we go? Might as well get this over with. Really, you starting to wish I had flash fire. Whoa, whoa, bo. Whoa, bo, bo, bo. Careful, Black Star. There's mud everywhere. Oh, jeez. It has the roar of an alpha. Uh oh. I, I might need these. I want them all. Oh, jeez. It's merely walking into me. Uh. Whoa, it stopped? That was weird. It's like it got stuck or something. Okay, now you're just being mean, Adrian. I just want the balls of mud. Let me have the balls of mud. <laughs> nope. Tricked you. Back to the middle? No. Ooh. Uh, I guess I hit you with balls of mud? There's balls of mud everywhere. Yeah. 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 Don't kill me. Alright, um... Enter battle. Okay, um... Let's flamethrow it. Agile Earth Power. Even for legendaries, that's kind of scary. Um, Samurai's gonna kill it. Uh, let's just chuck Ultra Balls. I have broken the game more. <laughs> Got it. They definitely made them easier to catch in this. plate. <sighs> At least the heat let up a bit. With both Arcanine and heat transpew and flames about on a volcanic island, it certainly does get a bit toasty. Warden Niskin, I have to ask, do you think there was any need at all for me to be here? Uh, well, um, yes, of course there was. After all, you were the leader of the Pearl Clan, and this trouble cropped up right around the seat of one of your clan's nobles, so... Yes, it was surely best for you to come see to it. Admirable of you to look after your clan's affairs. Do you really think so? I was wondering if it might not be revenge for all the times I pushed Lena to train her Growlithe harder. That's surely not the case. 
Even if Warden Paulina may have mentioned something about the need for, um, tough love. I thought so. I think she was so patient and kind with Growlithe, but when it comes to me... Well, Blackstar, you did great. Yeah, well, just head back ahead of you. Alright, there's Heatran. Other legendaries here. Shoot, where even are the legendaries going in the in this place? Right here. I feel like they should have their own box. I really do. Really. Thirty-one. No, wait. Yeah, this will work actually. Put those there, and then um, and we move these over here. This should work. Oh shoot, I forgot about Mantike. Such bad shiny. Even I couldn't tell. I've told some rough stuff. <laughs> uh, do that. Palkia. Dialga. Heatran. There we go. Caught myself a Heatran, I get a thousand bucks for it. Oh, I'm done using Flamethrower. Oh, I gotta give it Fire Blast. That's, yep, some Esper Wings, that's good. Oh no, I wish you used Strong Style with it. Strong, Agile, Fire Fang, Magma Storm. Huh? Well, at least he started himself. Back to the village. Hmm. Who's next? Um. You know what? I'm gonna go catch my old friend Mesper. about weather. You weren't here before. Must be Black Sorry, yeah, I heard of you from my. Thanks for taking my request. So this little guy here and lost. I was wandering around in tears when I stumbled across the beautiful flowers. This is where I met a Pokemon I'd never seen before. He gave me a flower and then sat off walking as to guide me. So I followed it and led me back to the place to recognize. I forgot the proper thing it went. Tell how grateful I am. Find a field of flowers. Oh, it's Shaman. Might as well go catch that one here. It's called a Gracidia flower. It's the same flower as the one the Pokemon gave me. Um, I have an idea. I do indeed have an idea. Like, right over here.
Is this the field from back then? The flowers may be withered, but I remember these surroundings exactly. This place ha this has to be the place. Excuse me, can you hear me, kind Pokemon? A long time ago I got lost out here. You guided me back. I don't know if I had made it home without you, so I came to say... Thank you so much! The flower! Oh, now that's pretty. Oh, it's Jamin! Thank you very much, Blackstar. I'll make sure to thank Mai for pointing me towards you as well. I suppose you'll be staying here to study the Pokémon. Oh, good luck. Good luck with your work. Guess I'm catching it. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, uh, hi, Shaman. Oh, Jerk. So much for tranquility. Uh oh. Back here. Ooh, you're a toughie. And this is why I bought a thousand Ultra Ball. Got it. Yep, there's the crit. 
Jesus is taking all the hits. Gonna hurt, Samurai. Prisoner's Joy, I think I gave it a concussion. <laughs> uh, that's all that. Uh, hey, Professor! I got Shaman and Chris. No, not Chris Elliot. Mesprit. What do they need? Earth power, seed flare, strong and agile. Mystical power. Well, thanks for using a lot of those recover. Okay, that makes sense why there's so many. It's a legendary. I'll give it that one. But come on, that is ridiculous. 70 agile? Fine. Might as well deal with the worst now. Mystical power. <laughs> yes. I know what I'm doing tomorrow. I'm gonna make an as I'll go boom. Actually, there was a quest here. I should probably go check that. At least go accept it. It was right up here. Oh, it's Adam Man! If this is Black Star, good timing. I found some treasure you'd be interested in. Did that make your ears perk up? Happy to fill you in if you're curious. Oh yeah, sure. There's the survey core spirit. Curiosity is what moves science forward, according to good old Mr. Professor. But come to think of it, 
What I found seems too valuable. Just let you have it. Let you in on it for free. You'll need a little work. Here's the deal. I want you to show me what's in your mind, your heart, your soul. In short, battle me. Oh, okay. I can do that. Then, then it's on. Time to see what you got. Here I come, knowing full well how tough you are for the future of the Diamond Clan. Yep, that's what I was saying. That's much worse than I was expecting, actually. We've got the bulk. Take out the on. It literally just started raining. It's like he just gets a free rain dance. That's fair, I guess. Doesn't there, like... Damage dealt by fire moves is really... Glad I killed that before it started raining. Um, actually, if I send out Lily Gun, she just straight up counters both of the other ones. Punch Umbreon. Something, I'm a man of my word. So here's that treasure. Adamant crystal. When used on Dialga, the large glowing gem wells with power and allows the Pokemon to change forms. Ooh, used to be my grandfather's. He said it was somehow related to Almighty Sin. I mean, to Mighty Dialga. So now that I've put you through the ringer a little, it seems right to give it to you since you're the one who caught Mighty Dialga. You know, I ought to tell you, I'm glad it was you who fell out of the sky to us. You taught me another way to get along with Pokemon. Another way to relate to the world. And three comet shards. Oh boy, you're just loading me with money. So that must mean in the ice area, in the ice lands, Irida wants to give me the thing for Palkia. will pop up at the Highlands now. Pop up there, get Cresselia. Might as well get Darkrai too. We'll start it with Darkrai. Who comes out at night, they said. are like over in here so maybe if I just warp here and roam I might be able to find it oh well that was easy <laughs> yep there he is Up on him. 
and I get a free hit. So, flame throw. Perfect. myself now, but I won't ever forget what you did. Farewell, young one. A large candy. And then there was Cresselia. I should probably go get those requests. You? Ah, balloons. Burst 40 balloons. Ultimate balloon race. A feel. Oh boy, it's Melly. Lovely. I don't suppose a grunt like you would even know. But I guess it behooves me to ask. Do you know the Pokemon called Triselia? Uh, yeah, I do. Well, I figured you know. I wouldn't expect any less from someone who managed to defeat me, even if it was just a fluke. Ah, uh, Cresselia is said to be the very embodiment of the crescent moon. Her feathers are called lunar feathers, and legend says that if you hold one as you fall asleep, you'll be visited with wondrous dreams. I, can, I call her a nightmare, that pesky Cresselia. She depended upon Moonview Arena and caused my lord to hide away. I'm so worried about Electrode that I can't even sleep. Never mind, dream. Think you might be able to catch Cresselia and perhaps even claim one of those lunar feathers? Oh, do catch the... No, no what's wrong with... Do get the pesky flying croissant. <laughs> do it for my poor Electrode. I suppose Cresselia can't be all bad if she at least recognizes the perfection of the arena looked after with loving care by the great Melly. Okay, I'll catch Cresselia. Luan! Oh, oh. What? Inverse controls? Not good. <laughs> Quick, enter battle. Enter battle. Come on. Just enter battle. I do not want to put with inverse controls. Flame car. Cresselia holding dark plate. Well, well.
Well, this is unexpected. Instead of a lunar feather, you got some kind of a plate. I do feel Pala emanating from it, though. In any case, if Cresselia did not gift us with any of her feathers, then I suppose she would have... She thought we had no need for them. Not bad at all, Grunt. I suppose anyone with enough luck to best the Great Melly should be able to handle at least that much. Thinking about it, a half -re competent person like you might actually make a decent sparring partner to help my lord and I grow stronger still. I will go back to the settlement and, and tell the others about the feather that we didn't get. Alright. Now I head to the ice lands. Blessing, strong and agile. Okay. Oh, there's a happening out. I'm not even going to that outbreak. I'm just not. Nope. Incredibly, incredibly, incredibly precious thing I found. Are you curious? Tantalized? Oh, I am indeed. As you should be. There isn't a single person in all of that Tisui who wouldn't be interested in treasure. But anyways, before I show you, can you guess what I want to do? A battle. Yes, exactly. I want to be able to achieve feats like yours. <laughs> like what you did atop Mount Coronet. Now give me one moment. I need to center myself. Okay. Take your time. And center yourself. Partners and I are going to get stronger and travel across this wide world. Oh, and the hail stop. <laughs> Ooh. Espeon and Flareon. That's odd, though. We're still missing uh, a Jolteon and a Sylveon. Tails. 
I wonder, Blackstar, are there people even stronger than you out in the world, with Pokemon stronger than yours? I'll just have to find out for myself, I suppose. Here, the treasure I promised you. The Luster's Globe. There's the Palkia turns it into the horse. I'm told this once belonged to the founder of the Pearl Clan. It's somehow connected to Almighty Sin- Uh, I mean, to Mighty Palkia, I mean. Since Mighty Palkia is with you now, I can entrust the Luster's Globe to you, too. Thank you for everything. to get in. <laughs> oh, one not expect to run into you up here. What are you up to? You're here to try and find the secrets lurking in Snowpoint Temple, aren't you? That's what my clairvoyance told me. You do tend to get mixed up in all kinds of strange going on. This door here, while well, they say behind it sleeps a Pokemon so great it could tow around the entirety of the continents that lie to the south. No matter what we do, the door just won't seem to open. Me like this. Stone iron. The plates instead of the Reggies? Okay. Guess that makes sense. They couldn't have another game with the Reggies after basically every game having the Reggies after they came out. Owen had them. Platinum had them. Black 2, White 2. Uh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. The Sword and Shield. And Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. Every gen has had them. Since their release. What in time is that thing? It's colossal! It sure seems to be a Pokemon, but let's see what my clairvoyance has to say. Definitely a Pokemon. My clairvoyant showed me a vision of it in motion. That's kind of cool looking, actually. Hello, Regigigas. Let's fight. 
since you just want to be the robot. You. It has its ability. Oh, that's dumb. This isn't worth it. Really? You have to make a plate for normal. Now that was one solid Pokemon, like a giant born of the very earth. I guess this is just part of your job with the survey course, huh? What kind of Pokemon is the one you just caught? I can't wait to see it in the Pokedex when it's done. Yeah, I'm pretty curious to read everything Mr. Professor writes up, too. See you, Blackstar. We should do another chase sometime. Can't just... Can I just warp out? Head back to a retreat. Mm. I would. But there's a storm coming, so I have to be done for the night. Oh well, I'm starting to get tired anyways. Just report this. Let's see what we what I gotta do for them. This actually gives me more mods to work on, which is just what I needed apparently. The Mystical Power, Calm Mind, Strong and Agile, Iron Head, Giga Impact, Strong and Agile. Not even Crush Grip? Okay. I'll just return to the village, and I'm going to save there and say thank you for joining me. It looks like there's still more I gotta do. I'm not finishing. I have finished main game tonight. Post game is going to be tomorrow's stream. Thank you all. See you on the next episode. Bye-bye.